officers swarmed Cohasset tonight for a strange and scary incident. A man wielding a chainsaw barricading himself in his home with his two young children. Hours earlier, Cohasset police say the man used that chainsaw in an effort to cut his way into police headquarters. Good evening to you. Ken McLeod with you on this Sunday night. The standoff on Cushing Road lasted six hours and ended when police cleverly rescued the kids and then stormed the house where police feared the man might have a stash of weapons. WBZ's Brandon Truitt has been following the story all day. Tense moments in an otherwise picturesque Cohasset. SWAT team surrounding this home on Cushing Road. A man barricading himself inside with his two children, both under five years old. Cohasset police say it started around 2.30 Sunday afternoon when the suspect drove his truck onto the lawn of the police station, pulled out a gas-powered chainsaw and used it to try to get inside. A secretary just feet behind the door flagged police and ran for cover. The suspect drove away and led police to his home. We've been to the residence before, so we have a general um, uh, knowledge about the layout. SWAT negotiators worked for hours to try to talk the man out of the home. All the while, his two children were inside. Police say the kid's mother was on scene and helped provide information for negotiators. Over the next few hours, our cameras caught the suspect opening a window above the garage. The man threw things out at random, yelled at negotiators, and asked for an ambulance. Police used drones to get a look from above. SWAT members used a lift to reach the second floor. Neighbors walking by were Stunned. It's a nice little neighborhood, people quiet to do their own things, and uh, it's just, it's really an unhappy circumstance. Police Chief William Quigley says after about six hours, the decision was made to move in. It got to the point where we became um, seriously concerned for the children. We hadn't heard or seen them in more than 90 minutes. Uh, so the decision was made to uh, to enter. SWAT members entered through a back door as police distracted the suspect at the front of the home. Police say they found the two children in a room together unharmed. The suspect was tased and put under arrest. We're willing to you know, spend the time and resources to, to bring it to the, this resolution. This Again, this is the best case scenario. Um, everybody's safe and uh, especially those children. Police would not name the suspect. They say he has been taken to South Shore Hospital for a mental health evaluation as well as for those injuries from being tased. The children are in the custody of their mother as well as their grandfather. The suspect could be arraigned as soon as Monday. He is facing several felony charges. In Cohasset, Brandon Truett, WBZ News.